good morning good morning people um good morning fellas look at those dogs you see them uh, they scared me um i'm off to the gym right now i usually go to the gym around around this time no around afternoon and today i thought i'd try something else Man, those dogs are still barking. Uh, today is going to be a vlog. I remember I posted a vlog once on this channel. And today I'll post another one. Uh, um, I'll record how I spend my day. And yeah, keep up the work. What's up, guys? Um, I'm already at the gym. And I'm uh, getting ready for the workout. Let's get this. guys i'm from the gym and i'm heading home then i bathe take a shower and then we start trading i'll meet you there um i'm just from taking a shower and i'm about to start trading i'm waiting for my pc to load and someone told me jbp jpy and i want to check it out to see if there is a proper signal all right guys this is how my analysis for usd jpy is going to look as you see this is where i'm waiting for it to break and retest and retest this is a support and this is this is a support and this is the resistance so once it break so this hits this support and comes back down once it hits this resistance and comes back down to this support and then goes back up and comes back down while it's going back up here i'll suggest that it's going back up here so i'll wait for it to come back up and break here and then buy from here and put the stop loss just below this this resistance this support and take profit over here the first take profit will be here because there is some resistance here the second will be here and the third here i'm hoping to put the fourth here and someone told me jbp jpy uh this is how it's looking i'm looking to buying waiting for it to break waiting for it to hit this support because it has hit this support for three consecutive times hit this support comes back up 
this resistance comes back down a new support comes here and I take profit here I think the first take profit will be I guess here that's where the first take profit will be and the second will be here and USD JPY no US 100 this is how it's looking it has come into uh it was in an uptrend now it has come into a parallel trend i think that's what it's called then i'm waiting for it to break retest comes back down to its previous trend line or it continues up comes back and retests and then goes all the way all the way up here and since it has broken here there's a higher chance of it of me buying it has already broken its trend line and there's a higher chance of me buying it to go above and this is us 30 us 30 i'm looking on buying at first bought around here sometime back and shoot all the way up here and this were huge profits now i'm hoping of it to come back to retest as as you see it's coming back down to retest then breaks uh breaks around yeah there and retest the resistance is there it comes back down retests i buy here since this is like the third if you're to draw a trend line like this like this this is a third and i'll buy here put the stop loss here and take profit here uh xa usd gold in short um i'm looking on buys because there is one test retest here another touch here on the trend line i'm waiting for it to come back down here and touches then if it comes back up here it will have made this resistance this on this these candles then comes back down because there's a lot of resistance here then i buy then i put a stop loss just below just just at this candle this candlestick here and put the tech profit all the way up here i'm looking to moving it up here no i'll put it up here and the euro usd this is how euro usd is looking i'm looking on selling since it has been in a downtrend for all this time and these chart patterns look like it's going to drop and downtrend then a triangle uh this support has been this resistance has been kept let me put it um here this resistance has been kept for a long time and three more than three times one two three four five so i'll wait for it to come back down then it comes here breaks the trend line comes and retests because that's always what it does then sell and put the top profit all the way up here that will be a uh, three risk to reward one to three point three nine and the stop loss just here at one point zero two two three eight those those are how all my trades for most likely this week or this or today if possible because i prefer trading them on a daily as you see here it has already begun it has started going up and it's gonna come down here and i buy and then it goes back up and us 100 us 100 are uh, still in the parallel trending uh here us 30 still coming down because 
train line hasn't been broken down up here first let's just check on the one hour time frame uh one number still it hasn't broken uh uh gold gold looking on buying but yeah i'm looking on buying once it breaks looks like something else let me see looks like something like this also i'm looking on buying really soon it may not come back down here i put this trend line set if it comes back down if it breaks this trend line i'm sure it's going to come back around here around here goes back up here comes back down i buy and put a stop loss around here and take profit up here that's that's what it's looking like here let me move this to here uh yeah and your usd uh still the same still keeping this trend line in fact it's looks like it's descending it's going to descend and the candlesticks have already begun and that's how my trades are going to take place well um, guys that's those are my trades for today and i'm going to i'm done analyzing i'm going to take breakfast and i begin reading i'll meet you there time to read um currently i'm currently reading man's search for meaning a uh, good book i recommend it to everyone who wants to who's having down times and sometimes you have some fa some fa failures along the road and you want to get back up uh so you're saying this yeah it really shows you that in everything of life there is a meaning and you can check it out man search for meaning really good book time to read what's up guys um i'm pretty sad because my ball my ball has has a problem it's it's tube the air is getting out of this tube and a basketball can be fixed as i've been told this tube can be fixed i tried putting super glue but it failed I tried putting glue but it failed and now i got no ball to practice my handles um i might think that um i'm going to do forex so that you get the money to buy a new ball and i'll keep you guys updated when i buy i'll keep you updated when i buy the new ball and this is really um devastating i wanted to go and practice my handles because i haven't been at it for like um three weeks one yeah like one month and i've been procrastinating a lot and also i realized something people used to tell me that okay to meditating in the new age the meditations of the new age are not christian like people used to tell me that and i've just got to got it in my conscious that the not of the christian they're not biblic, biblical biblical so um i've started i'm going to start doing christian meditation which is like 
meditating on the word, reading the Bible and meditating on the word on and on.